So we've learned I want, now the word for you want, which is quieres, quieres. So remember, Q U, always a K, and the I E is the Y. So quieres, quieres. Can you say that for me? Quieres. Good. You want to buy? Quieres comprar. Good. Quieres comprar. Good. You want to buy this? Quieres comprar. Good. Quieres comprar esto. You want to buy this for me? Quieres comprar esto para mí. Perfect. Now, let's try and form a question. Now, in English, at the start of a question with you want, we would put the word do, and that's a question marker. So, do you want? Now, as I said in the beginning, the first lesson, questions are actually a lot more simple in Spanish. Now, as we learn, word order doesn't change from when it's a statement to a question. So, in Spanish, they say something like, you want to buy, you want to buy. And in fact, occasionally in English, we might say that informally. So we might say, you want a cup of tea? And when we do, we have to rate, that's why we use that intonation in our voice to make it sound like a question because there's not that question marker do before so how would you say do you want to buy quieres comprar good up more on the quieres quieres comprar perfect brilliant quieres comprar quieres comprar excellent so do you want to buy brilliant Okay, so another useful word for forming questions is the word for why. And that's por qué, por qué. Now you'll notice that it's two words. Literally they mean for what. So, por qué, can you say that for me? Okay. Brilliant. To say why do you want to buy this, remember there's not that word do. So in Spanish we say why you want to buy this. So how would you say that? ¿Por qué quieres comprar esto? Perfect. ¿Por qué quieres comprar esto? Why you want to buy this. Good. How would you say, why is it important? ¿Por qué es importante? Good. Make it sound like a question. ¿Por qué es importante? Good. ¿Por qué es importante? Good. How do, would you say, it's not important? No es importante. Good. So that's a statement. No es importante. Now, using that, we can ask a question with why using isn't. So, why isn't it important? So, how would you, you, how would you phrase that? ¿Por qué mm -hmm. no es importante? Brilliant. ¿Por qué no es importante? So, why not? It's important. We're literally saying, good. And if we wanted to say, um, why don't you want to buy this? Why don't you want to buy this? How might you say that? ¿Por qué no quieres comprar esto? Perfect, you got it, first time. ¿Por qué no quieres comprar esto? So, ¿por qué no? Why don't? Or why isn't? Excellent. The word for because is also the same word, por qué, but we join those two words together. <clears throat> so 
So you've got two words for the price of one there. So say that for me once more. Por qué? Por qué? Good. And you don't need to raise your voice on the qué because we're not asking a question. Excellent. So can you say for me because it's important? Por qué es importante? Perfect. Por qué es importante? Because it's important for me. Por qué es importante para mí. Excellent. Because it's not important for me. Por qué no es importante para mí. Excellent. So, question for you then. Por qué quieres comprar esto? Por qué quieres comprar esto? Okay. Oh, quiero comprar esto porque es importante. Brilliant. Excellent. Well done. Okay, now I'm going to ask you um, why not. So, ¿por qué no quieres comprar esto? ¿Por qué no quieres comprar esto? You got it, brilliant. What was going to trick you up there? So, no quiero comprar esto. I don't want to buy this. Porque no es importante. Because it's not important. Excellent. Now, the last word that we're going to learn today is the word for now. And that's ahora. Ahora. The H in Spanish is never sounded. Okay, so it's a hora, a hora. These are two words together. You've got to and hour. So you're sort of saying to the hour, now, to the hour. Okay, so a hora. Now the R here, between these two vowels, if we go back to what we learned before, the pronunciation is a little bit different from English. Um, if we think of that word again, the way that the Americans might say butter, so they say butter, butter, that r, r is the Spanish R. It's like a D. The double T in butter almost becomes like a D, butter. So, ahora, ahora. Do you want to give it a go? Ahora. Good. Once more? Ahora. Good. So, I want to buy this now. Quiero comprar esto ahora. Good. I want to buy this for me now. Quiero comprar esto para mí ahora. Good. Quiero comprar esto para mí ahora. Good. So you hear that sound in quiero. And you hear that sounding para, ahora, ra, ra. Good, good pronunciation. Um, how would you say it's important now? Es importante ahora. Good. Because it's important now? Porque es importante ahora. Good. And lastly, this is not important for me now. This is not important. Esto no es importante. For me now. Para mí ahora. Brilliant. So, question. ¿Quieres comprar esto ahora? ¿Quieres comprar esto ahora? Sí, quiero comprar esto ahora. Perfect. ¿Por qué quieres comprar esto ahora? Quiero...
quiero comprar esto ahora porque mm -hmm. es importante para mí. Perfect. Now it. Well done. Brilliant. Good pronunciation. You're making really good progress. Well done. Make sure to leave a comment down below how you're finding the course so far, if you're enjoying it. Make sure to use some of the vocabulary that we've learned so far. And also, if you're looking to expand your vocabulary, make sure to also check out the series of short stories that we have on this channel. I'll leave a link card at the end of this video, so make sure to give them, give them a look. Give, give them a look, give them a read. <laughs>